Hey, Chaos, when would you say is probably the best time to record what is probably the final session of Pokemon Ultra Sun? Ah, uh, you know, I'd say like 5.30 a.m. the day after Christmas. Sounds about right. I don't know why I'm awake at 5.35 a.m. Uh, CST the day after Christmas, but hey, here we are. So I'm recording these videos so that they'll go up later today because I'll probably end up falling asleep at like 10 a.m. and sleeping until 5 p.m. So we'll see how that goes. Anyways, I'm awake for some reason. Let's play some Pokemon. What could potentially be the final session? This idiot is still doing this, huh? If you got time to just stand there chilling, hurry up and get to the Priz. Don't worry. No one... Yeah, words. Don't worry. Anyone who comes here is getting a beat down. Yeah. All right, then. I thought that we'd get another cutscene with Guzma, but we did not. Do I want to lead with Nog and Adele? I probably want to lead Rocky and potentially get up Stealth Rocks. I don't know if we're going to, like, walk in here and fight Getsis, or if we're just going to go fight Giovanni and be done with it. I'm going to be pretty mad if they didn't put Getsis in the game. Chaos, look. The hidden door behind the mirror is unlocked, and now we can use the war panel. Man, who could have done that? I knew you could do it, Chaos. Here, let me heal your Pokemon first. Yeah, you better. Now let's go. Yep, let's do it. The time is nigh. What could finally be the end of this playthrough? We, this is, I might only be getting one, maybe two videos tops out of this. Yes, my boy! Well now, what do we have here? I come out wondering what the commotion is. Only to find the, the, only to find the door to the center of the castle ajar and intruders running wild. It seems those team leaders from other worlds are not nearly as useful as I had hoped. Who are you? Where is my mother? You haven't harmed her, have you? Getsis' hair looks really blonde in 3D. Mother, you say? I see. You're the daughter of the president. My name is Getsis. I am representing Team Plasma. I, too, was summoned from another world, much like the other leaders you've defeated. Mm, well, you know, there's kind of a theme going on with leaders from other worlds. Just saying. There is no need to worry. You will find the president up ahead blissfully asleep and dreaming. Please tell me you froze her in those frozen carbonite things like she did with those Pokemon. By the way, I want to say, this actually just reminded me. I've had some people, I've mentioned numerous times why is Luzumine mean sudden, Luzumine, mean, Luzumine, mean, have your surname? Why is she suddenly, like, not crazy and evil and all that? And a couple of comments have told me, oh, it's because she wasn't corrupted by Ultra Beasts in this game. She wasn't corrupted by Nihilego and all of them. She still froze all of those Pokemon in ice or whatever. She is still insane. Like, Ultra Beast corruption or no. She's, she's like, incredibly evil crazy. So, I completely disagree with the theory of, oh, the Ultra Beasts didn't make Luzamine incredibly evil in this game like they do in Sun and Moon. I, I don't buy it. I think Luzamine is naturally incredibly evil and crazy, but uh, in this game, for some reason, they just gloss over that fact. But yeah, let's, uh, let's continue. Mother! Ah, oh, get blocked. Not, ah, not so fast. Please get out of my way. Yeah, I'm sure you'll listen. Unfortunately, I cannot let you go beyond this point. You see, I have been thinking long and hard about the reason I have been sent to this world. And now, I believe I finally have the answer. My purpose, it is to travel between the worlds, freeing all Pokemon from foolish people. And at the same time, consolidate all the power in all the worlds to myself. Yep, this is the Getsis I know. In order to achieve this beautiful ideal, however, I have need of a useful pawn. And that man, the leader of Team Rocket, is a man of pure evil. If I can make good use of him and set him up as a king, I shall be able to reign supreme above all existence. So essentially, you're using Giovanni as your new in. I like it. I have found that humans, with their predictable ambitions, are easier to use and control than a freak without a human heart. Ah! Call back to the best Pokemon character to ever exist. It wouldn't do at all to have you get in his way, especially when I must establish him as my king. You got a serious fixation on this whole king idea. Must you insist on interfering with my plans? Very well then. All obstacles to my ambitions must be removed. Yo, I'm glad they set up Getsis as the last one before Giovanni. This is pretty sick. You're challenged by Team Plasma Getsis! Let's go, my dude. I've been looking forward to this. A Cafagrigus! 
All right, there, there, Cathagoras should not be able to Oko me by any stretch of the imagination. So I can get a, uh, can get my Stealth Rocks up here easy. So we will do that. You're going to have, if you don't have Kyurem, you're going to have Zekrom or Reshiram. I was told that there are version differences, uh, version differences on who has what legendary Pokemon. Like if I was playing Ultra Moon, Instead of... I'm really mad about missing Stone Edge, by the way, just to get you curious. Instead of missing... Or instead of fighting Dialga and Xerneas, it would have been Palkia and Yvitel. So... He could... He probably has... I'm gonna guess that he has Zekrom. And if I was playing Ultra Moon, he would have Reshiram. I got a 50-50 shot of being right. Or I, I guess I got like a 33% chance of being right, because he might just have Kiro. No, if he had Kyura, this is uh, black and white one. You would get a Spadef drop the second I switch in my Pokemon with a dark type move. Screw you, Cathagrius. I, I, I have to switch out into something. I guess I'm going to have to let Rocky die. I can't have him. I can't be at minus one Spadef. He'll do a KO me. That's incredibly irritating. I may as well try... Well, I mean, I guess I could... Oh, yes. Uh, no. Uh, no. I love Getsis' theme. I had actually completely forgotten that he has, like, one of the best evil themes of all time. You... Uh, can we stop with me getting hacked every time I load up this game? Hey, if we do finish this game today, by the way, we're going to get to, uh, you guys are going to be getting some Insurgents videos soon. I'm looking forward to getting back to that. All right, this time, let's not get a Spadef drop as soon as I switch in. Actually, if you could Will-O-Wisp this turn, that'd be fantastic. That's, that's not a Will-O-Wisp. That's not a Will-O-Wisp at all. I wasn't even close to a Will-O-Wisp. What did you think that was supposed to do? Get crunched on, fool. That did nothing. Where are my defense drops? How is this guy getting spadef drops, but I'm not getting defense drops? Did I live another one of those? I did 69 damage, right? I think it did. I should live one of those if I don't get high rolled. Oh, okay. Hydrogen, hey. It's been a while, buddy. How you doing? One of the greatest Pokemon of all time right here. Still didn't get my spadef drop. Not cool. Uh, da 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 da. I might die here, but I want to heal Rocky and bring him in to, uh... Well, actually, Naganadel should be able... Nah, Hydreigon, Hydreigon, whatever you say it, being six levels ahead, probably faster. I need to, like, this is a dark type, though, and dark types always give me trouble. So I do need... I'm definitely dead to a surf. I need to be able to hit this thing with some fighting type moves. Go, Rocky, Go! My boy. Jim gave his life for this moment. Yeah, it's faster than Rocky. So it's definitely faster than Naganadel. This might run through my team. I limped. Critical? Who? I did get the crit. I was about to say who needs crits, but I actually just got the crit. Finally, some hacks in my favor. Uh, Bufalant. Slowbro should be able to 1v1 a Bufalant. If I get a burn, great. Even if I don't, uh, my Fizz Def should be fantastic. This theme is so good. Give me some burns. Give me some burns. You have Megahorn, and you landed it. Please burn. I need to burn. If I burn here, then I can stay in and heal off and win. Oh, come on, video game. You know what? I can still heal off until you miss, because Megahorn is like... 80 accurate or something. Does my going to have 5 PP? I think it has 10. Easiest dodge of Slowbro's career. This time I will burn 100%. And I'll just keep dodging as well, so it doesn't even matter. Yeah, he dies the next one, so I don't even need the burn. Yeah, who cares? Whatever. Stab Scald for the win. Watch him crit me right here. I'm calling it. Nope, never mind. Finally, the tides have turned to my favor. All right, Bufalon is down. Not bad, not bad. 
What else you got? Bisharp. That is a scary Pokemon. Can you stop having all of these dark types? All right, I have to hope and pray that he does not have Sucker Punch. Because if he has Sucker Punch, I'm about to be a very upset person. Don't have Sucker Punch. Yes! Get out of here, Bisharp. You ain't living a quad effective fighting type move. I don't care if it's not Stab. Level 71 for Dave 2.0! Getting up there. Pythagoras. Unfortunately, Jim has perished. Uh, not gonna Dell. You know what? You might actually be able to set up, outspeed whatever legendary dragon he has, and just win? Wow, wow, wow. Alright, well, let's set up a nasty plot. I do outspeed you. I'm not sure if I outspeed whatever his legendary dragon is. Oh no, I've been willow wisped. Now my fell stinger strategy will never pan out. Alright. I mean. Yes, nasty plot again. Because I can. I'm going to be at plus five for whatever his dragon is. So as long as I do outspeed his dragon, I've got this in the bag. That did no damage. Cathagrigus is so weak. See you later, buddy. Get Dragon Pulse. It's been real. I'm at plus four. I don't care how bulky you are. Go ahead and buff me up to plus five, please. Many thanks. All right. What dragon do you have? Is it Zekrom like I think it is? Well, I guess Zekrom would better fit on the moon game, wouldn't he? Oh, it is Zekrom. I was right. Hey, check it. You never even had a legendary Pokemon in your game. What is this? All of the legendary Pokemon look so small. They're all like six foot tall. They're all the same size as their trainers. Do -do. Oh, I switched Acid Downpour. I forgot about that. Whatever. He'll still die. I'm at plus five. Bye, Zekrom. I should have let you use, like, Bolt Strike or something first, just so I could see what it looks like, but whatever. It is what it is. Acid Downpour. Fare thee well, Legendary Dragon. Man, remember when Getsis had a Zekrom that he, like, stole from in at some point? Level 61, Naga Nadel can now defeat anyone. Oh, dude, your speed is so close to being higher than your Spitak. Can we please make that happen? Level 68 for Rocky as well is pretty good. I couldn't have been defeated by some random trainer from who knows where. Happens to you a lot nowadays, doesn't it, Getsis? What? I created Team Plasma with my own hands. I'm absolutely perfect. I am perfection. I am the perfect ruler of a perfect new world. You lost. Now please, step aside. This cannot be possible. I will not accept this. Oh, is he gonna kidnap a small child? Ah! I mean, you didn't really have to knock her over. <laughs> no, 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 no. You don't get it, do you? I can't be defeated. I won't be. It cannot be allowed. Getsis is the most interesting of all of the evil villains and anyone who says otherwise is just wrong he's got like the most character the most evil everything it's it's great like the coolest plan and he and his team has the coolest character of all time and in you tiny intruder yeah tiny if you value this girl's life throw aside all your pokeballs at this moment and he's actually smart look at this take hostage tell person to throw their pokeballs aside this is this is how you be an evil leader. You cowardly. Chaos, please, don't listen to him. I'll totally sacrifice you to beat Getsis. Don't worry. Shut your mouth. What's this? Your Pokeballs are shaking. Could it be that they're shaking with rage? No matter. Throw away all your Pokeballs right this instant. Uh, I refuse. Were you not listening or did you simply not understand? Well, you leave me no choice. This girl must. I see you're still dedicated to your own desires, Getsis. Why is Colorus here? And since when could Colorus teleport? You. It has been a while. I thought that Getsis didn't... 
Wait, wait a minute. Chorus did not exist until Black 2 and White 2. Why would Getsis know? Oh, no, wait. What? No, wait. No, he said you. He, he knows who Chorus is. Why does this version of Getsis know who Chorus is? Miss Lily, it is good to see you again. Do you have to keep tapping on that wrist thing during this? This is, like, really annoying for you to keep making that sound. We can't... We, we can. We ran into each other in the lab, perhaps you recall. Mr. Chorus. And you, Chaos. We meet again. Miss Wick had sent word that you may need assistance. You'll have to forgive my rudeness, but I followed your trail using an invisibility device I recently invented. What? It seems Getsis here has caused you quite some trouble. Although it appears this Getsis is from a different world than the one I know. Of course. The Chorus of this world. But you should have no reason to meddle in my plans. Oh, please. I simply despise you, Getsis. That's enough reason for me. Not by Getsis, it's been real. What's this? My body is being pulled. No. No! Now, ah, well, it was real. Oh, hey, my Gyazo's updated. Th thanks for that important information that I don't really need right now. It seems like repeated use is not a problem, even with the prototype. I should have known Colorus Machine number 1102 would work. Thank you for helping us, Mr. Colorus. But what did you do to that man? Nah, he, he got camweed. His entire body is gone. I simply adjusted his dimensional channel, if you will, and sent him back to his original world. But Getsis is a man with power to match his ambition. He is not someone to be taken lightly. I can only hope that the taste of defeat will keep that Getsis out of trouble in his world, as if. Y yes. But turning Aether Paradise back to its original form, with all the different worlds mixing together, that won't be easy, even for me. There is tremendous power of evil at the center of the castle. If we can remove that man's twisted desires, the Colorus machine should be able to revert everything back to normal. But can we, like, keep the castle looking awesome instead? You mean Team Rocket's boss? If we can do something about him, everything will be fixed? Indeed, Miss Lily. You are a very sharp young lady. I would like to study this castle, however, so I leave the rest to you two. Oh, we don't get to see Cyrus and, uh... And, uh, okay, the Gyazo update thing is, like, a small speech bubble that will not go away, and I can't see how long I've been recording. That's really annoying, so stop that. There we go. I don't get to see Cyrus and Lysander be transported back like I did. You are still doing this. I wanted to see them get transported back just like Getsis and, uh, Maxi and Archie. Here, let me heal your Pokemon. Yeah, you better. I may not be very good at Pokemon battles, but I know a thing or two about Pokemon healing. Yeah, yep. Yeah. All right, well, I guess I'm going to lead Rocky still. My levels have gotten so out of whack by the end of this playthrough. Uh, yeah. I think we're good to go. So, I mean, let's do this. It's time to take down, take down Giovanni and be done with this playthrough. 